America, America, God has his reason on me. Hello, people of America and other English speaking nations. My name is Larry McFile, and I'm here today to talk about documentaries. You may say it's the documentary inside the documentary. <laughs> uh, well, thanks to my assistant, we have now the information and the studies of long time. Yes, that made no sense, just like my mustache. <laughs> well, without further ado, let's learn. Hmm. The first documentary was created in 1923, 22, <laughs> by Robert Flaherty in the Canadian land. However, most scenes were staged, unlike this show. <laughs> Without further ado, let's delve deeper into the documentary to learn more. <laughs> oh, I didn't see you there. Well, I'm back with another study on documentaries. So, my assistant piled together some new information regarding what we were studying which was the history of the documentary and how it affected the modern population so all you young 90s kids or 80s kids or 60s kids or 70s kids because i don't know when this movie came out <laughs> well jaws right Picture this, the jaws covered, but underneath, shark attack. This documentary was about the shark attack, how it affected the humans. This affected the modern population, you might add, by making us more aware. That just sounded like an 8th grade science project. <laughs> Well, I've done a little bit of research on my own, and I actually figured out that the first documentary was with the ancient Greeks, give or take. They performed it in the theater instead of on our modern computer screen. Now you may be wondering, huh, Larry, what are you talking about? <laughs> well, on my most recent trip to Greece, I brought back this. Oh, wait. I uh, stole that. Uh, I picked it up off the street in Greece. Uh, one second. Uh, I'll be back to you with my recent findings about the documentary in Greece. Stay tuned for commercials. This is the new iPhone 7. Great phone. Beautiful display. And the best thing is. Oh, we're sponsoring Larry on his quest for the documentary. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's just it. I am Larry. <laughs> well, you yeah, know, there are such things as budget cuts. I can't afford to even film this thing. Well, either way, back to you, Steve, where we're going to be driving to ancient Greece. Ah! <laughs> oh, well, we brought in one of the locals to talk about the documentaries that we're learning about that I learned from Wikipedia. Let's go! Yes. Παρακαλώ πηγαίνετε μακριά. Είστε ένας παραλυρητικές άνθρωπος. Δεν ξέρω τίποτα από όσα λέτε. Hey, 
what did we learn about from Herder Fiend? That the ancient Greeks really did not create the concept of documentaries and that you cannot trust Wikipedia. B. You can learn a lot from me, Larry McFile. I can be a helpful person. And C. Let's look in the giant book of documentary guidance for a nice quote. Maybe the documentary of quotes. Ah, I don't think there is such thing. There probably is, but you know, for now, I will go with this. If life gives you lemons, give them to Larry McFile because I absolutely love lemonade. It's been a pleasure talking to you, and I'll see ya on the flip side, or in jail, whichever one comes first. Goodbye! Δεν με νοιάζει. Παρακαλώ πηγαίνετε μακριά. Είστε ένας παραλυρητικής άνθρωπος. Δεν ξέρω τίποτα από όσα λέτε. Yeah, y'all can't read that. <laughs> And you, <laughs> I'm scared. See you on Act One, a documentary about documentaries. Well, there goes my eyebrow. <laughs> <laughs> It's already... Yeah, y'all can't read that. <laughs> And you, <laughs> I'm scared. See you on Act One, a documentary about documentaries. Beautiful display. <laughs> Camera. <laughs> What?